Hello guys, um, today I am going to be touring a name I cannot say, <laughs> Ag Agarist Agarista Mansion, Agar Ag <laughs> alright I haven't personally watched um, the Miraculous Ladybug show, so if I did I probably would know how to say this, but I really do not know Agarist I think it might just be a greased, a greased, a greased. Right. Anyway, it is by your local flonker. You know she is very talented. You've seen a lot of her builds on multiple channels. But yeah, I'm going to be having a look around today. It is one million one hundred and sixty-four thousand four hundred and seventy-three dollars. It's already got nine sales, and we'll get stuck in. Let me just zoom. There we go. Right. So. From first opinion, I mean, it is definitely very grand looking, and I am absolutely shocked by the way it looks. I mean, as I said, I haven't seen the series, but this is kind of inspirational, the build. It is just so grand, and the way it's all stacked, the roof, I mean, wow. Okay, so I'm going to go in the front gate. And I have to say, I do love the door. I noticed it on the little picture um, on the marketplace. And I was like, okay, no, I have to have a look. I understand this is for um, Lady Squad contest kind of thing. I haven't really been paying attention that much. But yeah, I know this is for um, one of her contests. But I mean, look at it. It's absolutely amazing. I mean, the driveway, I assume, yeah, this is the driveway, kind of. I know the garage is there, but this is like the grand entrance. I'll have a quick look down here. Okay. Peek around the corner. Look, even put little rocks here and there. Okay. This is different. <laughs> I'm not sure at all what that is. But it is a very odd bedroom. I mean, it's it's in the outside. I I mean, it's very clever. I like the fact there's a bunk bed. I'm just a bit confused to why it's outside. Okay. Who? Uh, what? What? I mean okay I am so confused but amazed at the same time okay so I am gonna go I guess back this way I, I don't want to miss anything but I'm kind of curious is this just does this just take you to the other side? Oh no. Oh, oh, oh. On that note, I am going to go back the way I came. It's a bit of a maze. Bear with me. Bear with me. I'm getting there slowly. Okay, back into the mysterious bedroom. Okay, okay. So there is another door over here, and I'm a bit scared. I think this might be the garage. I don't want to get lost again. Okay, yeah, this is the garage. Pretty basic garage, but it does look great with the details. Okay, we will head inside the massive, massive front door. And, I mean, I already love the floor. The stairs look great. I mean, look how grand is that staircase? I mean, wow. They've done it with the shoe boxes, and I'm not sure even what this. Did they do that wall where you go down? Yeah, yeah, I think they did. That is really clever, and I do like the look of that. Okay, so I will go. I'll go in here. Otherwise, I will get completely lost. Okay. I'm loving what they did with this lights. 
this light, it's this light. I might actually have to steal that idea. And I will obviously give her credit because that is what you're meant to do. Um, but yeah, so I will have to give her credit because, I mean, if it's anything like this, there's going to be other bits on there to get inspiration from. Okay, so I, lo I love the pink sofas. That, that is a TV, isn't it? I mean, I'm a little confused about the TV. But I love what they've done with the art. Two decals just for that. And I have to say, I'm really loving what they've done for the picture lights. What is it? Okay, this is... Oh, no, I'm going to get lost again. Can I fit? Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. See, I was thinking this was a hallway. It's not a hallway. Okay, so... Okay. Okay, we'll go, go back this way now that we know what that is. I assume that thing that we found earlier was a kind of a layer or like kind of like a bat cave, but for whatever this series is. Is that another one? No, it's not, thank God. I don't want to find any more hidden things. I'm going to get lost. Okay, so I will go this way. Wow. See, I always struggle to colour these walls. The, the panelling. I always struggle to colour it. I've been literally having so many builds where it's just white. Because I have no idea how to colour it. But I mean, I am obsessed with the table. Again, I might have to steal some ideas because I've got a massive dining room that I'm a bit like, okay, well, there's not a table big enough. Okay, so, okay, can I get through here? Because I always struggle. This is the ki kitchen or like bottom floor kitchen, possibly. And you have a pantry. Okay, I will struggle and try to get. Oh no. Can I, can I, yes, okay. So it's one of these really fancy kitchens where you have an upstairs in the kitchen. And obviously then you come down, you've got all your food and it's like, okay, let's go through if you can get downstairs. But yeah, I absolutely love the depth of this room. I mean, it's a double floor dining room. I personally, in my new build that I'm doing at the moment, I've got a, a double floor kitchen uh, where it's just all open for like this. But I mean, look how grand this is, the fireplace. The, the black wall panelling that I had no idea you could do and I'm really jealous of because I'm going to have to work out how you do that now. Oh, okay. Another lighting effect. They would have looked great with... I think that's lighting. But yeah, they would have looked great with the spotlights on the bottom if, it, if you can do that. I mean, it might even have spotlights in it. I'm not sure. Okay, so I'll have a quick look here. And it is a very simple but modern looking bathroom. Okay, okay, okay. So we will run around here. Oh, okay. Hallway. Okay, oh, before I go in there, you have a very nice looking cinema. Very grand looking. Very loud. I will turn it off. My headset's very loud in here nice nice little i guess a lounge chill area kind of thing i like that the fireplace is not exactly on the floor because i've never been able to really use them fireplaces i've never been a massive fan but it looks great in here all the white well not white but neutral colored books the little tv which is so random but i love it what's that oh the little japanese table okay let's have a look and this is, wow, detailed. Again, <laughs> I have never thought about putting certificates on the wall. That is really quite a good detail. I'm actually surprised how, wow. Like, I know I know she's an amazing builder, but I mean, I'm gobsmacked. Instead of shelves, she's used, um, obviously she has used shelves to probably get them up there, but she's used the marble slabs and all the way around to make shelves look better and wow i mean this is definitely worth the money and now i get to go up these really really grand staircase 
Okay, so I assume they are the characters, and this is massive. Ah, uh, do you know what I would really hate about this so far? That not this specific house, just the game in general. That the arches, like the single arches, are so low. Can't we just have some high arches, some round high arches as well? Like I just feel it's too tall going through these. Okay, not what I expected. Okay, let's have a. It's a art fashion room. I'm. I assume it is a a fashion room. You got the picture of the dresses and what looks like fabric and maybe dyes. I could be wrong. I have no idea what that means, but I could be wrong. But it does look good. Oh, okay. Can I go? Okay, just a. Oh, it's the mops. Okay. See. Oh, I didn't know there was that. I'll get to that. I really like the little sitting area here. Oh, is there going to be more little rooms? More? Okay, that's the bathroom. Or a bathroom. And it's like a mini library nook. Jesus, that's a big TV. It would be like... You're in the TV in this room, but it does look so good with the decal. Okay, so coming out here. Okay, that's just that. Okay. I'm getting very, very confused. Oh, okay. I like this. Uh, I'd say this is like teenage boy kind of vibes. See, I've never... Is that... I can't tell. Is that... What floor texture is that? It looks like carpet, but I mean, whenever I've been looking at this, I believe it looks like pebbles to me. It makes so much sense. I've literally been using grass as like a rug. This looks so much more like carpet. Wardrobe's good. I personally have used decals before for a wardrobe and it just looks so much better because we don't really have the amazing wardrobes that they have in Bloxburg. But I mean, you know how it is sometimes. And we'll get there eventually. We have this amazing map. And yes, they've got some better furniture, but I mean, they've still got the same map. Nothing's changed about the map. They're in a canyon with rocks all around. We're in the middle of the ocean. We are evolved. Okay, so this is like some little computer right there on the side of the bedroom, which is really nice. I guess you could go there and you could study or do what I'm doing and record yourself walking around people's homes. <laughs> um, and this must be another bedroom, if I can... Oh, it's just a bathroom. Okay. Just a simple toilet that does look very detailed and I'm loving it. Okay, so now I've just got to find... My way, yeah. Wait, 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 wait. Ah, ah, oh, ah, okay. Okay, okay, I'll go this way. Oh, okay. Okay, can we go in here? I'm not sure what this is. I want to say storage or wine. It's got the power box, so it's definitely some kind of closet or cupboard. Oh, 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 no, 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 no. I wish you could lock them. I always try to edit them by accident. Okay, so this is... Oh, it's a bedroom. I was going to say, an office with Netflix. Okay, I'm not going to get any work done. Okay, uh, oh, okay, I would expect another hallway. Oh, I like this one. I claim it. I claim this bedroom. Modern, very tumbler. I'm liking it. That can be my little office desk. I love what they've done with the table. Very modern table. I never... Like, I've thought about doing it before, but I've never been able to angle the things right to get what I particularly like. Like, what you have in your head, sometimes it's hard to get out in the build. But I'm loving what they've actually done. I think that might be just floor, possibly. No, it's roof, my bad. It's roofing, I think. But it's really clever. I'm loving it. Okay, I think... Oh, my coffee's run out. I have slowed down, so please bear with me. Another little... No, the one across the hall is still mine. Same kind of theme, but the one across the hall is mine. Oh my god, there's more. Okay, I am going to have to run back down to the kitchen at this rate. Oh, la la la. Ooh la la, I like it. <laughs> it is very clever. I mean, 
that I love that. I've continuously struggled to get a modern looking shower and I'm loving what she has done. I'm not sure what they are. What are they? What are they? I'm not sure what they are, but made like the tap version. You've got the sprinkler coming from somewhere. But I'm loving it. I am absolutely loving this build. Okay, can I, can I have a look? Oh, okay. Hello, door. Hello, door, my old friend. Oh, the headboard. Uh, you've got to love having a featured piece in a room. And I'm not going to lie, the big wall TV does stand out as well. But I mean, I love anything. Like, I love features. In a lot of my builds, I'll have like neutral colours and I'll have like a main thing because it's just a feature. But I love, I love the headboard here. Am I going to get lost? What is this? Wait, wait. There's more. Oh no, there's more stairs I need to. Okay. Oh, I... A whale. I'm very confused. Oh my god. I was so confused. I was going to say, when did we get Lego blocks? Okay. Let's just take a minute to appreciate how creative she is. I mean, Lego blocks out of doorbells. I mean, wow. I am absolutely shocked, but I love it. And see, I am not sure how they did that, but I love what they've done. We're putting the round sofas and then the light. And I'm loving the creative basketball hoop. How is it connected to the, what is that? Oh, it's shelves. Okay. Yeah, to be honest, I love um, when you get a build and it's based off an original because you can just. I don't know. When you have a basic build that you're basing it off of, you can be so creative sometimes and because you've got to try and achieve the exact look. But then when you're starting from scratch and building your own thing, sometimes it's a bit like, ah, what can I do? What can I do? But as I said, I'm not sure if this is the room from it. I assume it is because how wow it is. But, I mean, wow. <laughs> I'm so confused. How? Oh, it's the pictures. It's meant to be an arcade. It took me a second. I thought it was like some kind of big display thing, but I'm loving it. So this, oh God, what could be in here? Okay, so this is a bathroom. I'm liking the stairs up and you got your shower again. I like that. I'm liking that a lot. The wardrobes we have are very basic. Looking. So when you do something like this, it's very nice. But I, I, I've done the thing with the mirrors. I love it. It's like bubble, like bubbles going up. Okay, I'm going to struggle to get up here. I know there's nothing really up here, I don't think. But, I mean, you can get a great view out the window. You've got the bookshelves up here. And, I mean, if I walk over to this edge, I don't know what accent that was either. And I don't know why I'm suddenly doing accents. But, yes, we'll stand here and we'll look out the window. And that is where I would stand forever. Like, to be honest, I'd turn this into my bedroom. I would be like, no. Oh, it is a bedroom. Okay, just take a second to realise what I messed up. This must be, like, the lead character's bedroom or something along them lines. Because there's me saying, oh, this would be my bedroom. But it is a bedroom with an amazing view. Okay, so I need to go up them stairs now because I'm getting so slow. I'm going to start getting the smell thing up here around me because I didn't get that bubble thing. Where you obviously you restart or reset when you're in the shower and you get bubbles and your health don't go down. I've had so many people ask why I've got a trail of bubbles following me in a certain area. But I don't have that on today. So if I'm not fast enough, I'm going to start getting smell. Like smell effects. Okay, so this is... I don't know, is this... <gasps> More secrets! Are you kidding me? <laughs> okay, I will I will go up there in a second. I've only just come up these stairs. Yes, I'm liking it. It's some kind of like office thing. Okay, wait, quick, wait, what? Okay, go in here and oh, look how grand this is. As you'll know from all my builds, I am a sucker for a decent office. 
I do love this. You've got like a little secretary bit kind of thing. And I love, as I said, I love how she's on the tables. But I mean, phew. this is some kind of next level criminal organization stuff. You would sit there and someone would walk in and be like, hello. And you'd be like stroking a white cat or a white rabbit. I mean, I am gobsmacked. Okay, so I, I think it's the same way. We'll go up here and if not, I'll go back down. And I will find them stairs again. I've still got to go look outside. This is a little bedroom. It's very nice. Very good for the space. I assume it's going to be the same this side. Which means there is a hidden secret. Because there is a hidden staircase. In here. Okay. So this is another themed bedroom. I'm liking the red accent colours. And the little table. We've seen that before. I love it. Okay, so again, it's another decent bedroom. And I have now got to go find that secret staircase. Oh, okay. Right, right, once I've found this, I've then somehow got to get back down the stairs as quick as possible while I'm as slow as a snail and have a look at the car. What? No way, is there an elevator? Where on earth is that going to take me? Am I going to, like, can I go down? No, I can only go up. I mean, I guess with a ceiling that big, it, boy, it's expected. Okay. I mean, I don't, I don't. Oh, it took me a second. I was gonna say I love how somehow it's glowing, but it's because she's got the neon lights. I think behind it. And I assume this is like a, a desk where maybe you talk to that. Um, again, I'm not 100% sure, but I mean, I love, I love the look of it when you walk in. I mean, if, if she doesn't win, I don't know. I mean, I haven't looked at the other houses. I'm not going to, I haven't looked at the other houses. I haven't looked at a competition, but I mean, this, this is breathtaking. It really is breathtaking. And I'm not even sure if I'm meant to be reviewing it. I know she's put in market, but it was entered into a competition. Oh, hopefully I can. Hopefully, I'm going to be alright uploading this. And now I've got to somehow get to the garden as well. But yeah, I'm, I think I should be alright uploading it. I mean, she did put it in the market. Yeah, I mean, I, I don't think... I don't know. I mean, I have massive respect for Lady Squad. And it's obviously her competition. I'm just looking around the house, right? Hopefully, hopefully she won't be mad at me. Hopefully... Miss Lady Squad will not be mad at me for looking around this house. I saw it, I was obsessed, and it was before I even knew it was anything to do with the Ladybug uh, series. Okay, how do I get outside? Um, I might have to walk around. And that's going to be an issue since I'm so slow. Okay, we're getting around very slowly. I'm going to be annoyed if I find a door down here. There's, there's probably a door, isn't there? Nope, door, okay. Seating area. Oh, okay. Bar. I like the bar. You always find me at the bar. Oh, okay. Okay, okay, okay. What is... Is this just a path? Yeah. Okay, so you've got your pool and your jacuzzi. Loving it. I had one like that in my villa thing that I did a while back. But I'm loving the light the like settings, the like features, and the different textures in the pool. You have something. I'm not sure what that is. By the looks of it... Oh, okay. It's for jousting. It is a jousting setup, by the looks of it. I love the fountain. And, of course, I love the tennis court. Almost all my builds have a tennis court. You cannot go wrong with a tennis court. But I absolutely love what she's done with that. The uh, what is it called? The the viewing box, um, the referee box. I'm not sure one, the two, three, whatever I said. But yeah, I mean this house is definitely worth its money. I've got very confused. Yeah, this house is worth it every penny, absolutely every penny. I mean, there's space to add like maybe a store if you wanted it. There is so much potential in other rooms. Like, don't get me wrong, she's done a mad mad detail but there's a lot of options to be able to create it 
your own kind of build. I mean, for me personally, if I bought this, because I don't really know the show, I would probably put an actual front door in. But, I mean, I love what she's done with the massive front door. I wish we had doors that big. But, I mean, I am absolutely shocked. This is an amazing build. But, yeah, so that would be it for this one. And I hope you've enjoyed watching me gasp at her amazing home. But yeah, so please leave, like, please leave a like, please leave a comment, let me know what you feel about this. Hopefully Lady Squad forgives me for touring it. But yeah, um, keep up to date with me, follow me, and I will hopefully be posting more. And I will, quick, quickly, quickly, I am working on the builds you've seen in the previous video. I'm getting there slowly. I'd like to do all my details. I'm very OCD about details. And if I rush it, I will mess up. But I mean, it's not just Roblox I play at the moment. I'm playing Rust. I am currently applying two separate jobs, property management and a video game tester. Very different jobs. But yes, yeah, so I am trying to keep everything in order. But I promise I will have a house for you soon. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for the next video. Yeah.